We've nearly reached the end of Mental Health Awareness Week. I hope everyone's checked in with their mental health. Mental health affects everyone. Even if you're a total ninja with perfect mental health, you still have mental health. So don't go, it don't affect me. Why is everyone banging on about mental health? Man up, belly button gazing. In my day, we didn't have mental health. That's not saying I don't have physical health. That means you're dead. If you're alive, you have a bonce and there's health that needs looking at. Now, I don't know about all the other rich world of work that's going on in mental health, but I do know about men and men that can't express themselves. So that's the area I focus on. I'm not suggesting it's more important than other aspects of mental health, but it's just something I know a bit about because that's the place I come from, the Kevs and Waynes and Lees and Dans of this world. So check in twice. If you've got an alpha male, knuckle-dragging, Neanderthal bloke, maybe he's got a triple ripple, maybe he's got a shaven head. He might even be a double-earing Gary. A shaven-headed, double-earing Gary in a vest. Nothing bothers me. He might be the one who can't express himself that needs to be checked in with. Look for clues on the WhatsApp group, lads. Look for clues. It's hidden. That's what men do. They hide their mental health within... Here's some fucking iCloud pics of some tits. Here's some Paul. Paul, here's a picture of a fight. Here's a goat being wanked off. Dave's not feeling very well. Here's a goat being wanked off. What was that? Dave was letting you know. So keep your ear open for Dave. As far as I understand it, there's not much difference between men and women, except women are better at surrounding themselves with other women that check in with them. Statistically, that's just simply the case. I'm not trying to offend anyone. It is. If the girls go, what's happening on with Leanne? Leanne doesn't look right. She's gone a bit grey. Her beak's gone grey. Guard Leanne's eggs. Form a circle. Guard Leanne. Check out Leanne. Go to Leanne's house now. Prosecco ambulance. Oh my God, let's make dildos out of wax and then light the bell end to create a wax dick candle. Hooray, I feel better. Whereas blokes, I think there's something wrong with Darren. Put him in the bushes. I don't want to watch it. Otherwise, all of us are going to lose our deposit to Falaraki because of Darren's problems. So just get better at checking in. Um, also, uh, don't just assume because someone's from a certain type of background, they don't experience issues. Uh, men also, men have got this male body dysmorphia now. Some men who look in the mirror and think, why am I built like a pepper army? When in fact they're 17 stone, back acne, shrunken penis, injecting steroids in their thighs. I just need to be a little bit bigger. It's what the women want. So don't forget to check in with anyone. And yes, it might all be goat porn on the boys' WhatsApp group, but you never know. There might be someone out there struggling. So send a message, send a second message, give a phone call. And hopefully from next Monday, if we're not all breathing in pure Indian variant coronavirus, we can actually go to a pub and check in with each other in person. Fucking man hug, smash the chest, check in, stay safe. We've all got mental health. And if you don't think we do, you're a bell end. <laughs>